And look, check this out. Let me give y'all some game to make y'all think, right? A lot of y'all be putting y'all life on the line for money, and money ain't worth your life, right? Now, if I told you it was a game you could play where you can win a trillion dollars, would you play it? You're like, hell yeah, I'll play that shit. Now, if I told you it's a game where it's five of y'all, it's a sport contact game, three of y'all can win a trillion dollars, but two of y'all might not make it and you might die. Would you play it? You're like, hell yeah, I'm an athletic ass nigga. I know I'm going to win that shit for sure. All right? Okay. You will play that shit for a trillion dollars. But if the doctor told you that you got one day to live, but if you give us a trillion dollars, you can live. Would you get that trillion dollars up to live? All right, that's what I thought. You would get that shit up, right? So why you put your life on the line for something you would turn around and spend just to get your life back? It's a cycle of stupidity, you feel me? You would put your freedom on the line right now. 10000 you would go hit a lick, right? But if you get caught and go to jail, you would pay that 10000 just to get right back out. You know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna stack that shit. You ain't gonna be like, man, when I get out, man, I'm gonna be, you understand? It ain't worth your life. Make sure it's worth your life if you're doing it. Ralph the OD7, baby, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And see, what y'all don't understand is it's Barry LX, Barry Compass, and we just added Ted City. You feel me? So, Ralph the OD7, baby, got a plan, right? And that's God's plan. So I'm a clickbait y'all. That's uh, let me say, get that out the way. I have to clickbait y'all because y'all don't want to listen, bro. I'm gonna give you what you want, but then I'm gonna give you what you need. You know what I'm saying? Now, then I Mike, bro. He talking that real deal. That's that real deal. He trying to tell you, right? Is the streets really worth it if you will pay whatever you just hustled up to get back? That's a conversation. You know what I'm saying? That everyone should ask themselves that's playing in the game of uh, no return. You see what I'm saying? Like, bro, today I got to go to my uncle's funeral. My great uncle, though. That nigga, ever since I was a little boy, used to shoot that shit in his veins. Bam, 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 boogie, man. Right? Y'all think this shit in the beginning is fun. But when I look around me, from my elders to my peers, they not here. They, I'm like, where they at? They in the upper room, bro. And as sad as it is, right, I had to find a way to keep their energy alive. So I started blogging, and I wanted to bring some good perspectives. Now, the reason being, right, is because I'm still the same person that I was when I was 15. Um, I'd do anything to any of y'all if y'all ever play with me, bruh. But I hope I can show you, show you and share love with y'all rather than share all this pain inside of my spirit, bruh. And I hope I detour you away from it. And I'm trying to bring you the names that you respect to detour you from it. They're trying to drop the knowledge, but when they do, nobody listens. So I'm going to clickbait y'all asses. Raphael D7, baby. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Bear Lex, Bear Compass. I see a lot of people losing. They don't know how to win. Sometimes breathing is winning. Living in sin. They're higher than most. Trying to see how high I can go. Always optimistic if you
take a price You took me from the jungle, so it's blood on the leaves It's blood on my hands, shit, it's blood on my sleeves It's blood on my heart, so it's blood that I bleed But it's love in my soul, so it's love that I need